kind of math would you see in the welding industry? Well, it all depends on what welding industry division you're in. If you're a tank fabricator and someone calls you and says, hey, I need a 5,285-gallon tank, you've got to know the math of calculations in order to know how big of a tank you can need to fabricate in order to satisfy the customer's needs. Okay, a 5,285-gallon tank. Now, how do we figure that one out? I ain't no mathematician, so I'm gonna have to put on my thinking glasses so I can look and appear to be smarter. So, we have to configure what does the customer want. I'm sure the customer is going to say they want a cylinder tank or do they want a rectangular tank. I'm, we're going to pretend, we're just going to assume that John King, the king of welding, wants me to build a 5,285 gallon cylinder tank. All we really need is either the height length of the tank and, or the radius, the diameter of the tank. We already have the volume, 1,220,835 cubic inches. 